this person, Luna Laura, they've got a pretty picture for their profile of a girl, yeah? And they sent me this stuff to say, like, do you want to be on the stream? I won't, I won't go to, I don't know what we're going to see on the Discord. But they sent me, you know, do you want stream emotes like everyone else, like the ones everyone else has, has got? Um, and then they clicked, I clicked the link they sent me. Right, I'm going to bin off Discord now, just so you can see the, the basic principle. Um, remove. And then they send me this link. I'm getting confused with too many windows now. And I want some relaxing Christmas music in the background. So they send me the link. I'll show you the link. So this is now Malfa Designers. And they do this, like everyone's got something like this. The two colors, pink and purple, purple and blue, or you know, whatever. And a logo and a, you know, everyone's the same on Twitch, aren't they? Everyone's got these anime faces. And there's all these pictures, yeah? Do I know if they rip these pictures off the internet? Like this one's got four approval written across it. For approval, for approval. The others didn't. Why don't all of them have that? Because some people write that on them and some people don't. And you've just ripped somebody's off the internet and put it on here. That's what I think might be happening there. I might be wrong. Um, but, you know, I could make a website like this if I just went around ripping loads of images off the internet, couldn't I? And then I bet, like, I'm guessing that you could get an AI design tool and just make somebody whatever they ask you for on the like I could type it into the AI and just get one of these out I bet there's an overlay like that's not complex it's not complex and if you're on Photoshop you can knock together a template and then you can use the same template for many people it just feels like there's I might be wrong but it feels like they're all the same and it feels like they're all being churned out from the same sort of I don't, I don't want to look the same as everyone else. We discussed this yesterday. So, um, But what I'm, I'm so surprised about, the thing I'm thinking is that there's a lot of these, there's a lot of bot accounts on Twitch and there's a lot of streamers and there's a lot of people trying to make money and all that. I think that this is not what they say they are. You know, I think some of these are their own images, some are not. I think behind it is probably two or three boys that have got AI. The, way, the reason I say boys is because they specifically always have female names, female avatars, and I think that's a sales technique. Like, a lot of young male streamers, like, oh, cute girls talking to me about art. Yeah, but a cute girl, I'd rather buy my art off a cute girl than off a uh, sweaty old man, right? Like, do you know what I mean? It just, I think that's part of the, the, the grind, and I think that it is a grind, and I think you can probably get art off them. You might get ripped off, you might get nothing, or you might get art. Um, either way, I don't think it's that valuable. Um, they're trying to get money from me. I thought they were going to do it out of the goodness of their hearts. I mean, I think whether they did something free or not, the concept is to poke me in this direction. Like They're sending me to this page at the end of it all. And this is a designer. E-commerce designer. E-commerce recruiting firm. Like... It's all a bit not what it says it was, isn't it? It's it's not some young girl making pictures on her laptop trying to help me out. That's not what it is. So I think it's just a marketing bullshit thing. And I think there's loads of them. I think there's a million of them. I don't even think that's their picture. You know, I can drag that off there. And I can see the, in fact, I can see the JPEG artifacts around that. I don't know if you can see it on screen. But what there is, is there's a little bit of like, what you would call, um, static noise it's jpeg compression artifacts for where you've ripped that off somebody else's youtube page and uploaded it yourself that's not even your art like you can see that it's not even consistent with a, a style these styles are all different and this one's got four approval written on it so it's not even their art i would guess they've either got someone cheap they use or or some like you know uh, generator they use and you're getting ripped off if you use them I wouldn't and also not only are you getting ripped off if I use them and they gave me something like that then I would look just like every other generic streamer it would it would make it worse for my stream to be noticed and it would make it worse for my stream to seem professional because I'd look like I just got that off Microsoft clip art streamer tools and 
the borders as well. You know, the idea of a frame, of a overlay, is that you have these borders. Well, I've created a frame here to border what I'm looking at because as a joke to say it. I, I don't need that because you're on the internet and your border is the actual border of your device. <laughs> like, you know, I'm adding, with that there, I'm adding in extra crap on the screen to confuse and distract you where I actually want the thing that you're looking at to be the most obvious. Like, you don't watch the telly and they start bringing up all these weird frames and borders. The news do it a little bit. The news have it a little bit, don't they? But um, I don't know why it's such a, a norm in in streaming to have this, but they think it's important and artwork is saleable. Look, this one's got a sample written all over it, but none of the others do. And it doesn't seem right to me that, that the style should be so different. So I don't believe in them. I don't trust them. And I get messages off not just one, but many. So... Uh, she seemed quite reasonable and normal in chat yesterday, but bear in mind she's not here in chat today. She's not a real supporter, she's not a real follower or a fan. It was somebody who probably has um, I've pinned a message. Okay, that was a mistake. Did it by accident. Um, the uh, I don't know. Yeah, they probably they're probably a bot, and they're probably just programmed to go in Twitch chats and just, you know, hammer out the messages. Or it could be a real person spending time trying to, because that would generate money. And if you're a young artist or an older artist or anyone, whatever, you've got your, your product to sell, your artworks. You don't even have to make them yourself, you know, you've got them to sell. But uh, the marketing trick of getting them to be sold if you go direct to a streamer and talk to them in chat and make a personal connection, they think you're a young girl, and uh, like, then you're halfway on. That's probably a better marketing trick than just making a website. So um, that's why they're doing it. Yeah, I'm rolling down Rodeo with a shotgun. 